Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel, just here and there. This is Ronald. This video is about the largest unfinished Catholic church in the world, Spain, Barcelona, Sagrada Familia. It is designed by famous architect Antoni Gaudi. His work on Sagrada Familia is a part of UNESCO World Heritage Site. It is one of the most iconic landmark in Barcelona and truly an exceptional basilica, and there is no doubt about it. Today, more than 135 years after laying of the cornerstone, construction still continues on this basilica. The most recent date set for the Sagrada Familia's completion is 2026. But still, you can go inside and see the amazing work of Antoni Gaudi. When we went this June, there were no ticket counters there. And also, nobody was selling tickets for 2x or 3x price. The only way was to go to their website and buy online. The price for one adult with audio guide app is 26 euros and I'll give all the information about the website in the description box below. Most important, during summer, tickets do sell out, so please plan well in advance. It is 100% worth going inside this basilica. The interior of Sagrada Familia is even more spectacular and remarkable than outside of the church. The Sagrada Familia is Antoni Gaudi's best known work and has become an undisputed symbol of Barcelona. This unique structure has been under construction since 1882. Its unfinished state can be attributed to a combination of factors, including changes in the design, funding challenges, and external events like civil war in Spain and also COVID-19 pandemic. The church has taken longer to construct than one might imagine. Antoni Gaudi has gotten involved with the project when he was in 30s. And from 1914, he focused exclusively on the church. Antoni Gaudi was well known and respected. In 1883, Gaudi began designing this beautiful Sagrada Familia, an engineering masterpiece. Nicknamed God's architect, Gaudi stated that he designed and built all his work for the glory of God. He didn't marry or have children, instead focusing steadfastly on his work. In 1926, during his daily walk to confession, Gaudi was hit by a tram and died. At the death of Antoni Gaudi in 1926, not even a quarter of the work has been completed. Only in 2010 did the church pass the midway point. As of now, the estimated year of completion is 2026, marking the 100th year of Gaudi's death. When completed in 2026, Sagrada Familia would have taken 10 times longer than the Great Pyramids, 123 years more than the Taj Mahal and 50 years more than the Great Wall of China to be constructed. Spain's most popular tourist attraction, the Basilica is visited by almost 5 million people each year, with a further 20 million people visiting the area just to look at it. Sagrada Familia's interiors is a reflection of nature and Christianity. You can discover Antoni Gaudi's stunning architecture as you walk through this basilica. The interiors of Sagrada Familia are designed to represent nature, with columns as trees and various creatures hidden throughout the basilica. Moreover, he believed that the work of humans should not exceed the work of God, and designed the central tower to be a meter shorter than the Mount Juice Hill of Barcelona. The towers of Sagrada Familia are dedicated to the life of Jesus Christ. The 18 towers all represent important figures in the life of Jesus. 12 of the towers represent his disciples, 4 towers are dedicated to Evangelist Matthew, Mark, Luke and John, another tower is dedicated to Virgin Mary and the tallest of all 18 towers is dedicated to Jesus Christ and will be topped by an impressive cross.
The interiors are indeed an exemplary showcase of Gaudi's Gothic naturalistic architecture full of religious symbolism and featuring several elements inspired by nature. The decorations mirror the values and visions of Gaudi himself that evolved along with the history of Sagrada Familia. I was really impressed with the beauty and I have never seen a church like this before. I wished Antoni Gaudi was there today. Kudos to Antoni Gaudi. Sagrada Familia is a phenomenal architectural wonder and engineering masterpiece situated in Barcelona. When completed, it will have 18 towers which will come together to form three glorious facades, namely the Nativity, the Passion and the Glory facades. A facade is basically a view that a few towers combine and create for the viewers. Today, only two of the three facades are complete. Sagrada Familia has a museum exhibiting graphic documents, drawing and models related to the history of construction. The museum also shows an interesting audiovisual presentation on the work and life of Gaudi. It was right here that the brilliant architect Antoni Gaudi spent the last years of his life. That's it for now and I hope you like this video. Hit the like button, share and subscribe if you like and I'll come up with a more interesting video next time. Until then, bye!